Assalamu alaikum. Welcome back to avoiding common errors in English. Let's learn another common mistake that we make in English so we can learn how we can avoid it and what's the exact rule in English. So here is the sentence. Can you identify the mistake? I need to finish all the lessons until Sunday. So did you find the mistake? You can pause the video if you want more time. All right, so there is this rule in English that we use until to talk about a situation that will continue up to a certain moment. That means we have the ending point and something is going to continue till that ending point. Then we would use until. If we have to talk about a single action or event that would happen before a future moment. So again, if we have a particular end point, but there is this action that is momentary and it would happen at any single point in the future. For that purpose, we would use by, not until. So by is often used with deadlines because whenever we have a deadline, so we do not continue doing the task till the end point. We have to do it by then. So any time before then. Any time means any single point before that deadline, not continuously till that time. Okay, so in previous sentence, we saw that we were talking about finishing the lessons, which, came, which we have to finish before Sunday. That means I can do it any time before Sunday. It's not like that I'll continue doing those lessons till Sunday. So the correct version would be use of by instead of until. Okay, so the, here will be the correct sentence. So reflect back on your writing and correctly use by and until. Good luck.